to face two men. And here, there you see the victims, perhaps, Sonny Rogers and Jerry Fox. They are, they won't be smiling after this match is over, I don't think. Man, this interrogator. What about this guy, the Covenant? Looks like a bad hombre. Seven feet tall, 320 pounds. the interrogator to meet these two men Sonny Rogers and Jerry Fox who will be operating as a tag team against the interrogator and I tell you we talked about the interrogator doc being seven feet tall 320 pounds this uh, recon is about six seven and sniper got to be six six and uh, that is a uh, Sonny Rogers the athlete and he striped tights. We want to document that because I got a feeling, Doc, this was not going to last long. I don't think it will, JR. I feel that they're going about this the wrong way. Rogers and Fox, they're going for the upper body. They need to take the legs out, much like Shawn Michaels did to The Undertaker. Well, I'll tell you, Shawn Michaels and The Undertaker, it's going to be a phenomenal matchup. Folks, you know how Shawn Michaels turns it up notch after notch on pay-per-view. You know what a big game player The Undertaker is. And you're going to see the best of both of those superstars this Sunday on pay-per-view. And again, the event is sold out. So if you don't have your ticket, uh, you can watch it from the front row of your living room on pay-per-view. JR, both Shawn Michaels and The Undertaker have been World Wrestling Federation oh. champion. Both of them, I am sure, are future Hall of Famers, but the first meeting ever this Sunday. The interrogator now, almost toying with Sonny Rogers and Jerry Fox, who had a combined weight of about 430 pounds, have been totally mismatched. I think this interrogator could beat four men of this caliber. Well, I'll tell you, JR, looking at the interrogator, the large size that he is reminds me what you said earlier. Shawn Michaels is a giant killer, and he rises to the occasion at pay-per-views. Shawn Michaels defeated Diesel. Shawn Michaels defeated Psycho Sid, and The Undertaker has to think about that as well. well that's a very good point, Doc, but let's not confuse the issue here. Diesel or Psycho Sid are not in the category of a undertaker they're not on his level and they never will be and uh, speaking of never will be the interrogator has dominated two men with ease i tell you Here's what this commandant has got quite the triumphant in the interrogator recon and sniper they're going to be a force to be reckoned with but, you know, I want to go back to ground zero for a second. Don't think for a second Stone Cold Steve Austin is just going to come down there, hand over the belt, and cause no trouble. Oh, my God, there's no telling what Austin's going to do. Austin has had his license suspended due to his injury. It was the only thing that WWF could do. It was the right decision. But Austin, no doubt, will be unleashed. He'll be uncontrollable. And Austin will be on pay-per-view this Sunday. And we'll be right back. 